welcome to the session. I am Asha and I am going to help you solve the following problem which says factorize each of the following. So first let us learn two identities with the help of which we will factorize both these problems. First is a cube plus b cube is equal to a plus b into a square minus a b plus b square and the second is a cube minus b cube is equal to a minus b into a square plus a b plus b square. So these two identities are a key idea with the help of which we will factorize the two given problems. Let us now start with the solution. And the first one we have to factorize is 27y cube plus 125z cube. Now 27y cube can be written as 3y whole cube. And 125z cube can be written as 5z whole cube. Now this is in the form of a cube plus b cube. Where a is equal to 3y and b is equal to 5z. And thus on applying identity 1, this can further be written as a plus b, that is 3y plus 5z. And the next bracket, we have a square, that is 3y whole square, minus a into b, that is 3y into 5z, plus b square, which is 5z whole square. is further equal to 3y plus 5z. 3y whole square is 9y square. And on multiplying 3y with 5z gives minus 15yz. And 5z whole square is 25z square. Hence, on factorizing 27y cube plus 125z cube, we get 3y plus 5 into 9y square minus 15yz plus 25z square. So this completes the first part. And now proceeding on to the second part. Where we have to factorize 64m cube minus 343 n cube. Now 64 m cube can be written as 4 m whole cube minus 343 n cube can be written as 7 n whole cube. Again, this is in the form of a cube minus b cube and here a is equal to 4 m and b is equal to 7 n. Thus I'm applying the second identity, it can be written as 4m minus 7n. And in the next bracket, a square, that is 4m whole square, plus a into b, that is 4m into 7n, plus b square, that is 7n whole square. Which can further be written as 4m minus 7n. In the next bracket, 4m whole square is 16m square. 4m into 7n is 28mn plus 7n whole square is 49n square. Thus in factorizing 64m cube minus 343n cube, we get the factors as 7n minus 7n into 16m square plus 28mn plus 49n square. So this completes the second part and hence the session. Hope you enjoyed it. Take care and have a good day.